Well, we've taken a minute to make sure that you all know that these car shows are big time family events. We've got twists going on over here, some girls dancing, some little kids dancing, having a great time. Right over here to my, to my left is some kids toys, some kids games, that kind of stuff. And then I've got Tom. Tom, you're president of the club, is that right? Yes, president of Butch Rods. Now, we talked, we talked about the cars, we talked about what this is all about, but this is about the veterans, and I've got one here standing here with us. What's your name? Rick Laws. Rick, nice to meet you. Thank you very much for having us out today as well. Now, Tom, tell us a little bit about the show and, and, and what this is for. Well, we're splitting it right down the middle. The Vietnam vets are taking care of half of it, and we're taking care of half of it. Uh, our half goes to kids having fun. Uh, we helped 27 kids at Christmas time last year. Uh, we brought four families Christmas dinner, complete Christmas dinners. Uh, we have a community day in Dobbinsville, and uh, everything is free there. The, we had a moon bounce, the dunk tank, cotton candy machines, and all kinds of games for the kids. And that's basically what we do with our money. Now there's another show coming up in Dobbinsville, coming up later in the season, right? Yeah, unfortunately we were rained out of June 12th, or June 20th rather. We're having it on September 12th. September 12th of this year, and uh, like I said, uh, you guys are more than welcome to come, and uh, it's for good benefit. It is a good benefit. You guys took care of a lot of a lot of families last year at Christmas, and you're going to do the same kind of stuff this year. Yeah. Now, now, do you have anything to do with like like with the veterans that are here, or that sort of, that sort of thing? How many we got out today? Well, we got quite a few out here today. Uh, this is the Vietnam vets, what we call our campground here. We settled up, we bought it, and. Uh, gives us a place to come on weekends and stuff like that. It's it's a really cool place. We shot the opener of the show right under the helicopter. Can you tell me about anything about that one? You know, that helicopter there flew in Vietnam in 71, 72, and when they had the movie, Once We Were Soldiers, yeah. that helicopter was used in that movie, and it uh, after the movie, it was donated to us. It's, it's a really cool feature here at the park. Well, thank you very much for having us out. Tom, thank you very much for hosting this event. And, I mean, what a great cause, what a great event. Thank you, Steve. Thank Crazy for Cars. I appreciate everything you're doing for us. I'm sure the kids do, too. Oh, I'm sure, I'm sure they do, and everybody's having a great time yeah. today. Yeah, it's a good time. Good turnout. Well, that was a great event down. John actually joined us down there for a short while. I saw you down there, down in Townsend. That was a good show down there with Bliss. That was a great show down there. And I think it's going to get bigger for those guys down. It's put on by a motorcycle club and it's also put on by the Blitz. Great. The car, car show. Yeah. From over in Newcastle. That's correct. Yeah. And, and he talked, be sure you go to their show over here later in the season. He talked about when it is. You'll also find that on the website, crazyforcars.com. John, there was another there was another event today posted on the website, and it's turned out to be huge. This has been it's been great. We're several hours in. We're far from over. Sun hasn't even set yet, but we're getting close. There's been no issues. There's hundreds no of cars. Issues, no I mean, problems. It's 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 outstanding. It's been a great event so far. I mean, how many cars? I'm trying. I'm going to try to count it in about an hour and see what, if I can come anywhere close to account for it. Right now, there's at least six, seven, eight hundred cars out here. Absolutely. That. And uh, it's bigger. Everyone stopped at different places. There's guys sitting along the curb with chairs watching cars cruise by. We're having fun down on the Kirkwood Highway. Yeah, down at, we were we were stationed down at the Park Lane Shopping Center at Steve's Sew and Vac. That's Steve's Sewing Machines and Vacuum Cleaners right here on Kirkwood Highway. Yeah, that was a shameless plug of my own. Be yeah. sure to stop in if you, for yeah. anything vacuum you cleaners. Do your own thing, we're, we're right here on Kirkwood Highway. I don't shoot very many right here in my own town. We're going to be back there at the parking lot later, so I just had to throw in a shameless plug. But yeah, that's that that was that was a freebie for me. But we're going to stop down at Hooters. We're going to stop down. There's looks like we just did a real quick drive yeah, by. The cars are sitting everywhere. I mean, they're sitting at the old gas station at Route 7 and Lime and uh, Kirkwood Highway. They're shooting at uh, the old steak and ale. They're sitting on the other side of McDonald's. They're sitting at Hooters. They're sitting everywhere along the Kirkwood Highway at different spots. They are. There's a, there's a couple speed shops right here on Kirkwood yeah. Highway, too. And from what I understand, we haven't made it to them yet, but they're down there as well. Yes, they're up at uh, Mezzas Atlantic Speed Center. So uh, it's fun. This, I'm happy it's worked. I'm glad the weather's co cooperated. There's no rain forecast till late tonight. So uh, this ought to be really great. 
make sure we thank everybody that's participated in this for doing the right thing, for not driving like like, like they're crazy, like maybe some well, of us do I, I really do appreciate the fact that everyone is behaving herself, and I have trouble at times doing that myself. Yeah, I know, me we too. All do. Everyone's doing a great job with it. Uh, there are no issues that I know of. Everything is fine. This is a great event. It's only going to get bigger year after year. <laughs> yeah, year after year, it's, it's going to happen. What's coming up next? Do you know of anything coming up next? Well, I have a show coming up at the Cecil County Drag Strip on uh, September 12th. It goes against the Blitz show. Because <laughs> uh, <that's, laughs> they're just, standing right here looking at me. <laughs> but that's okay. There's, there's, there's different, different type of people that go to the shows. There's, there's the drag race crowd, and there's the car show crowd. And they're really not actually geographically very close to one another. No, they're so not tell us about the show on the 12th. Um, it's going to be the, also the community day at uh, Dobbinsville, Newcastle, Delaware, um, the 12th. I want to say it's 9 o'clock in the morning. Not 100% sure, but I'm pretty close to it. I'm going to... That's close enough they can get there and get registered by then. Yeah. This is going to be another show like it kind of was today with the trophies and that sort of thing? Yes, sir. Absolutely. And there's a lot of stuff going on for the kids. There's going to be a dunk tank. There's also going to be another DJ. Um, a lot of, like I said, a lot of games for the kids. This, these are family events. If you're watching this, bring the kids in, bring mom, bring everybody. This is a family event. And it's not just for car guys. You're a car guy too, right? Maybe a car girl. Okay. <laughs> we'll be back.